Welcome back to AM. You know, if you're lucky, like Terry and me, you get a chance to eat out quite a bit in San Francisco. And, you know, you eat a lot of those heavy French sauces, and uh, you eat an awful lot of very rich food, and uh, every now and then you want just a nice, juicy hamburger somewhere. Well, the question is where to go. Well, we have with us today an expert on hamburger, as well as just about any kind of food you can get in a restaurant in San Francisco. KGO Radio and AM's food critic, Jack Shelton. Okay, there. You should yeah. explain that I'm not a member of the IRA, but, uh, <laughs> but uh, restaurant critics should not be recognized by restaurant owners, and that explains this silly getup. Has anybody ever recognized you, do you think? Oh, yes. Uh, I'd say about 15% of the places I go to uh, recognize me. Either they've met me at a party, or they rush up and mm -hmm. look at the back of me or something. But fortunately, about 85% I get away with. Plus, your voice, too, is pretty well. Voice is rough, from yeah. From KGO Radio, yeah. so that's going to yeah. give you away a few times. Yeah. Okay, let's get into it now. What We're talking about the great American hamburger now, and what are we talking about in the way, first of all, of ingredients? What, what, what really well, the, the, a good hamburger? the basic thing I think that should be in a good hamburger is the opposite of McDonald's. In other well, words, it shouldn't be... You're being un-American now. You well, realize, see, it? the trouble with McDonald's is it's pappy. By pappy, I mean it's too smooth, it's overground, it's cereal-like. It doesn't have that bite that good hamburger should have. Yeah. Hamburger should be coarsely ground. Ah, not ground up too not tight ground and too, too finely. Fine, no. huh? Okay. Now, if they, if they ground the hamburger at McDonald's coarsely ground, it would disappear. There isn't enough hamburger there. Oh, <laughs> zing. I think we're going to have to have Ronald on here, folks, sometime next week. Yeah. But there's one thing you have to say for McDonald's. Yeah. The hamburgers may not be very good, but the rolls are mushy. Well, we have something very unusual called Joe's Cable Car, mm -hmm. which is at 4320 Mission at Silva. Now, this is a unique situation. <laughs> I'm not too sure this couldn't qualify as, if not the best hamburger in San Francisco, close to it. I'm not Very there. close to it. Well, this is right out by Silva, right at the right, outer mission there. Right. Okay. And they not only grind the hamburger, but they do it in front of you all day long. You'll see him <laughs> grinding the hamburger with plastic gloves, and the owner does this. And the hamburger is very chunky, probably the chunkiest of all. Then they have a computer there, and you tell them what you want, and it's very creative. You can have a hamburger with a choice of six different cheeses, not just American cheese right from the package of Kraft's, but you can get mozzarella, you can get Ooh. Monterey Jack, you can get all these different cheeses, and then five, six different combinations. You can put anything on it you want, and it is delicious.